It's fastball. A blast to left field, and Nelson Cruz continues to pound the baseball. Number 23. And the Twins take the first lead, one to nothing. Twins were just three and six during the homestand, but Cruz hit five home runs and an early one now on the road trip. Talk about the high fastball. That fastball was just above the knees and the thigh area. Anything a little higher than that, it'd be a tougher for Cruz to get to. That fastball was right away with swing and that ball a long way. One down and now Rosario. August 8th, 9th, 10th, and 11th. Cruz with a drive to center. A bullet, and that one is gone. Nelson Cruz with two swings in Chicago and two tape measure home runs. Remember yesterday he had a swing and you could see him wince and he dropped the bat and we thought uh oh I think his wrist feels OK. It's a breaking ball he went up there he hit a fastball out the first time figured he'd just sit on a breaking ball. He got it with the first pitch and he hit a one iron out to center field. All right, he hit the fastball onto the concourse. He hit the breaking ball into the batter's eye. I have to invent something the next time he comes up. Here's Rosario. It's safe to say he's starting to heat up a little bit. Oh, oh man. I'm trying to use this change up this time against him. High fly right center field deep to the gap he's got three tonight. Nelson Cruz was his with his third home run of the night. And we're only in the fifth inning. Lucas Giolito had given up just 10 home runs all year long and the twins have hit four against him so far tonight. First at bat he hit a fastball <laughs> second he hit a curveball this at bat hits a change up. Over the Xfinity sign in center field. I find this hard to believe it's the first time in his career that Nelson Cruz has hit three home runs in a game. Three home runs on three different types of pitches from a guy like Giolito who does not give up very many home runs. What was the scouting report. What was the game plan for you that allowed you to have such an edge on him tonight. Just lucky. <laughs> um, just reacting to the pitches you know like you say he's a real pitcher and uh, any of those pitches that I hear they, I mean they can get you in trouble as a hitter. Um, just to be able to, to put the good one. Here we are. This is your 15th season in the big leagues, and we still have a career first for you. This is your first three home run night. How exciting is it for you to still have moments like this and to be able to help your team in such a big way? Definitely, it's, it's nice. You know, I think uh, at the end of the day, it's winning games. You know, and uh, it's all about pitching. So we're able to develop pretty well, and uh, hopefully, we can continue to, to pitch like that. You know. You guys made history tonight. That's the ninth game this season already where you've had at least five home runs. No team in baseball has ever been able to do that. Yeah, when you hear that, what comes to mind? Could you have imagined that this team would be this impressive when it comes to home runs at the start of the season? Well, I mean, baseball is crazy. Um, I, I know for sure we got a pretty good team and we can hit homers, you know. I uh, never imagined at this pace, you know, and to be able to stay consistent through the season. So. At the end of the day, it's about health. You know, we'll be able to stay healthy, and uh, the groups that we have, even the guys on the bench, you know, be able to come and help us. This was a great win for you guys, following what was really a tough homestand, some really tough battles. To have a big win like this, can this act as a little, little bit of a recharge for you guys to kick off this road trip? Well, I think we played pretty good. You know, um, at the end of the day, it's about winning and losses, but um, you can take a lot of positive from those losses that we got uh, there. We, we battled a lot, and. Um, even when we're behind for a lot of runs, we find a way to, to make it interesting.